Hi everybody, thanks for joining today. We're going to do activity number four in geometry, so thanks for joining. Remember, first thing, we're going to pause this video and explore, play with our blocks, and then turn it right back on and we'll get started. Great, I'm glad you're back and I hope you had fun exploring. Let's get started. We are going to talk today about area and the area of a square. So we're gonna make a square, let's make a square. I put down an eight dot block here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's got one, two, three, four on this side. So a square, remember from the last time we were working, has the same dots on each side. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. <clears throat> Great, so now we've got our square. Let's cover it and see what the area is. What's the area? So we're going to cover this with one dot blocks. Cover the area. So one, two, three, four. So we did one, two, three, four. We covered that part. So now we've got to cover some more. Let's put some more blocks in, another row. We haven't covered this whole thing yet. Great, we've got some of it covered. Let's keep going. Oh, let's move this one over a little bit, just for fun. So the area of a square, we're talking about how, what does it take to cover a square? So now we've got one more row to fill in. And now we've covered our square. Our square had four sides. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It takes 16 one dot block to cover a square that has four one dot blocks on each side. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So we have a square, it's got four dots on each side. We covered it, it took 16 one dot blocks. Let's draw what we've done and mark our progress charts. So pause this while we color and mark our progress charts. All right, everybody, welcome back. We've done our, we've colored this on our graph paper. Remember, you can download the graph paper on the website and the links are down below on the video. So let's look at what we drew. We have four dots on each side. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So our square has four dots on each side and it took 16 to cover it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Good job. So now let's write a little bit about what we did. So I put my name at the top of the paper and up here I put how you can figure out the area of a square. We had four blocks on each side, four, four, and we added another row of four, four, and another row of four. We have four fours equals 16. We can also write that like this. Four times, that's that little x, four equals 16. 
We can also write it for, put a little two up here, that means squared. Four squared equals 16. And now you know why they call it four squared, because it makes a square when you have four fours. So now let's see what we wrote. Okay, I've got area covers an object. That's what area means. We're covering an object. It took 16 one dot blocks to cover a square with four one dot blocks on each side. Four times four equals 16. Four plus four plus four plus four equals 16. And four with the little two up there, which means squared, four squared equals 16. Good job, everybody. Nice work. We also need to mark our progress charts. So I went to the geometry section and colored in number four activity. We're doing pretty good. And if you have just a plain piece of paper, that's good too. You can go to your geometry, and we made a little mark here, a little block, and colored it in because we've done one, two, three, four, four, four activities in geometry. Good job. Thanks for joining everybody. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And today we did activity number four in geometry. We learned all about area and squares. So that was an awesome time. I really enjoyed it. Thanks a lot, everybody. Love you.